It took me way too long to figure out what makes me happy, what lights me up inside, and to get the courage and the confidence to just effing own that. So I'm in a chapter in my life where I am not holding back. You're gonna get raw and real. I have a little bit of inner rebellion, I'm not gonna lie. Hello, beautiful soul and gorgeous human being. This channel is all about love, light, spirituality, and positive vibes only, lifting you up and leaving you better than I found you every single time. I learned early on in life to shrink. Shrink my voice, my dreams, my vision and ideas, my opinion, my confidence in who and what I am, my ability to express myself in a way that was unique and different, my playful personality and sense of humor, my ambition, my wild and free spirit, and my innate zest, optimism, and enthusiasm for life in general. I spent years running around trying to fit in and please and do the right thing, thinking I needed to rely on other people because my potential alone was insufficient and limited, thinking my light was not enough to stand on its own. Then one day I woke up and said, F that, I'm going to run this jungle myself and build my own castle. I'm going to do life my way by finding true north and creating a world around that mission and purpose, those values. I quit a successful corporate career, one I spent years, blood, sweat, and tears building and decided to start over from scratch. Not a day too late or too early. Perfect timing, as life always is. Wow. Crazy. You're crazy, girl. God, it took me a while to get here. Life is meant to be magical. It is meant to be lived. I really believe in that. But you know, you live and you learn and everything in due time and at the right time. You deserve to have the best life possible and get the absolute most out of this ride. If I can make a positive difference in that, then mission accomplished, baby. That is why I'm here and exactly what I'm here for. In the tarot deck, the Ace of Pentacles card represents a stable and grounded new beginning. Pure promise and potential, sourced from divine, a gift from spirit. As my relationship with God grew closer during what was another phase of huge spiritual awakening, one day he whispered in my ear, I love you. You've leveled up and you're ready. It's safe to jump. Here is your own pentacle. Take it and go make it 10. So here I am creating and living this new beginning based on what feels true and right and authentic to me. Honoring the gift of a pentacle by accepting the responsibility that I now have a divine assignment, a job that is much bigger than me. Somehow I found so much more peace than pressure in that. My stomach turns at the thought of public attention, being in the spotlight, and slaving to an algorithm. Privacy and discretion mean something to me. But I'm convinced this is where I belong and what I'm supposed to be doing. 
I know having a platform and sharing my love, light, wisdom, experience, and endless positive energy is part of my purpose in this lifetime. It's time to throw caution to the wind when it comes to fears, insecurities, and resistance related to obstacles that don't compare to the size of my heart and willingness to hustle for my dreams. Can I make a difference to you? Can I? I want to. I dream to. This is your happy, safe, sacred space. Stay close and connected by liking and subscribing so I can include you in my prayers and send you positive vibes. And most of all, so I can bring you content that is going to resonate and lift you up. Because I feel you and I got you, baby. Peace and love. Everything that you're consuming on a day-to-day -day basis influences how you feel and whether or not you're inspired and what your vibrational frequency is. And we know that the higher your vibration and frequency, the higher the quality of things and people and circumstances and opportunities, jobs and relationships that you attract, right? So many of us, I think, have like legacy relationships, friendships, connections, family, people that just have been around us and that we've been around for years and years and there's a lot of loyalty there and expectation and obligation, right? But as your soul evolves, if you seek out a level up or an upgrade in consciousness, it's hard to find a new soul tribe just overnight. They say that you're an average of the five people that you spend the most time around. The people that you're physically in the environment of, you are going to be exchanging energy with them of six feet from somebody you're going to be in their aura and they're in yours right but energy can transfer through online platforms too so on that note i'm sending you so much love and and good vibes and thank you for yours and let's keep exchanging it and just keep raising our overall vibe because we've only got one life and it goes too fast okay lots of love <laughs> i can't move she's a maniac so it's uh, 4 p.m. So I'm gonna go. Um, I hope you guys have a lovely rest of your evening. I am coming late tomorrow. I know I was a little bit um, late today as well, but I am coming late tomorrow. So um, don't expect me any time before eight. Uh, but yeah, today was good. Today was good. So I'll see you tomorrow, maybe, maybe. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't wanna. I don't wanna promise anything, but. Also, if you want to connect with me in other places, I would love to share what else I am doing on this beautiful planet Earth. Um, you can check the description box and see links to my Instagram and to my Substack. See you soon, baby. Bye.